like this is like the first 24 hours <laughs> yesterday at one-ish two-ish she woke up um, and then I put a cream and everything and that's when she told me no dummy is broken Persephone is broken I don't want it like and then she gave it to me and she's like and then I took it like put it away and everything and she's like no I want it still and then I gave it to my cleaning lady or she gave it to my cleaning lady and said um it's taken back what we call it's a break what we call and she's like and she does and when I told her to took it away and then she was screaming it's mine it's mine it's mine <laughs> so she's African so yeah but um, she knew it was gone and then we usually play like a game she put the dummy inside and then it's gone so she put the dummy inside then she's like right like oh, it's gone <laughs> and then she like check and then she take it out and then she also put it by her and then she also is crying then you need to give it to her so we play this game for like a few minutes afterwards and then I put my hands like this on my tummy and the dummy was on one hand underneath one hand and I put it like underneath the hand and then um, she left my hands up one by one and then I hold the dummy but I was like not showing her what's going on inside so I was holding her so she can't find the dummy so I was holding her or holding the dummy away from the side and then she was like wanting it and looking for it and when she looked to the other side I've put it at the back of her on my lap and then slowly but surely like open my legs so that she won't find it so just then I sat on it and a while after my cleaning lady came and I asked her to put it away and put it on the cupboard away so by this time she quite forgot about it and when she wanted to sleep she was crying for the dummy but good day everyone so i decided well not decided but needed very much me <laughs> not okay um was plus minus forced to sorry i'm just closing the windows but i was plus minus forced to start my youngest um, to take um, to lose her tummy I don't know how to say it perfectly to wean the dummy or whatever <laughs> so this afternoon or like yesterday Okay, so just one I wanted to make the video and then it starts crying again. But <laughs> so I wanted to start um I wanted to tell you I Yeah. So um I'm going to like I just wanna start this video and then I'm going to like bring you along with this process of me. Um so I'm just starting it and then I'll put on details of what happened how it works and so forth um, my oldest still needs to go into the room but we started at 5.30 <laughs> okay so what happened is she bits a dummy and I'll show you quickly how it looks like so it's now it's 40, 40 minutes I think okay so this is how it looks like so the reason why I need to because she started to bit it and now it looks like this so that is the reason why I need to start <laughs> I didn't want it to start today but that is the reason why I started and I didn't find the another um, the other one or the other one so um, I put her in bed 5.15 or 5.30 I went into the bed or bedroom um, to give a bottle again because I gave a bottle yeah. 
um, I gave a bottle and like that was quarter two. I gave her the bottle again because the moment she got into bed she just threw it away. So it's now 6.18 or 6.20 around there. It's now 20 most probably because I looked at my phone 6.18 and yes yeah, she's still she's now started to cry I think she heard a horror my conversation. Yeah, so she sleep. She must sleep, ne? Yeah, so she can't even damage her knee. So, trying to wean her. So I don't know how this process is going to be, but I'll take you along. Okay, come on, come, baby. So I'll take you along. Come. And then. I'll let you know tomorrow, so I'll write everything down and then I'll let you know tomorrow how it went and timing and everything, so let me see <laughs> how it's going. Okay, so my oldest is not quiet at all, but <laughs> so plus minus five, ten minutes after I spoke to you, um, what happened is yeah, she's screaming again like just across her room, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so what happened now is I went into the room of her getting the blanket or the bottle. It's like 20 minutes past that I went in before. Just offered the bottle again to her and told her, sorry, you don't have the bottle. Just like she stood up or she, sorry, you don't have the dummy. Just um, she's like stood straight and then I just put her back into bed and just left her and check. <laughs> And it's like three minutes, then she stopped crying. So, don't know why I need to do it tonight, but it's okay. We'll see and everything how it goes. So, I'll be, we'll be able to talk to you until my husband comes back, and then I will start writing it down. So, whatever is happening, and when I anyways remember what is going on and all the things. Um, She's busy. Yeah. She's busy um, making her teddy bear warm. So that is the story. So I'll talk to you in a bit. So I went in. So the first time I put her in the cot, uh, 15 minutes, I went in to give her a bottle again. 20 minutes, off of the bottle again. No. Half an hour. 35 minutes after I offer the bottle to her and see if she's wanting it. Just told her if she won't get the bottle anymore. And then I left her. But 20 minutes after she was started to cry again because I think she heard me. So it was she wasn't crying the whole 35 minutes. Emily! I'm so scared she walks into the room. So <laughs> her room is also there. So but yeah, so that's the story that I have for you now. I'll let you know uh, what is going on and how it goes every every few minutes. And hopefully she was sleeping. My daughter was like at the room, close to her, screaming and crying. She was actually not saying or doing anything. More like screaming, crying again. You need any better? Okay, so I'll talk to you in a bit. Um, otherwise, I'll talk to you tomorrow. So I'll take all and everything. I'll hear from my husband. I don't think he's going to do it so far, but we'll see how it goes later in the evening because I think the earliest part isn't the worst. I think the later part is worst. And so, or maybe if she's sleepy, because there's lots of times when she's waking up during the night, she's crying because she wants a dummy. And then you like, you look for it underneath the bed or something because we don't have like a thing. Or like it's permanently, like sometimes an half an hour look for it per, per day. So hopefully it will be lovely. It will be lovely if she don't have a dummy anymore. So which will be great because then we don't have to look permanently for it. So I'll talk to you in a bit. 
Okay, so it's 10 to, I was looking for my phone, but I can't not find it. So it's 10 to 6. A few minutes after I spoke to you before, my oldest wants to go in bed. So I should go and put her in bed. <laughs> my youngest was waking up, looking for a dummy wherever she was, wherever she left it. She was like looking around. Just to her shirt, she didn't have one. I went outside, put her. Uh, um, down and then I went in a few minutes later after I was looking for my phone couldn't find it still look at the time and then it was 10 to so. um, and then I just checked said to her sorry you don't have a dummy I was checking if she doesn't sit up just keep, um, offer her her bottle again but yeah now my oldest is outside naughty <laughs> but I will put it back Good morning everyone, so I'm quickly busy making some tea, so sorry if you hear something or I'm not concentrating on the screen as much, but as well as I'm looking through my notes I made last night. So yesterday when I spoke to you, the last moment I spoke to you is when my daughter woke up, my oldest, and I had to, she woke up and came out, well not woke up, it was literally 10 to 7. I put her in the cot, like she wasn't even there, I think five minutes or so. And she went out of the bed. And the moment she went out of the bed, um, she wanted a nappy to be changed. And I said, okay, it's the last time, I'm not changing it again. Um, but here is, I changed the nappy and put her in the cot. The moment I did that, it was around 7 o'clock, just before, just after, whatever, around there. I just put her back in the cot and my husband drove in and my daughter heard, my oldest heard the car and she's like, Papa is here! <laughs> and I was like, fine, it's like, it's slop. <laughs> and um, she was crying, my youngest was crying, they didn't want to go back to sleep, but yes, by this time my youngest was also crying. So, my husband got here and he bought milk, so yeah, it was 7 o'clock, he bought, so, I opened around 7 o'clock, he bought milk, um, for my youngest, he bought my youngest milk and yogurt, so I don't have milk, so I'm using my youngest, but very sad about it, but he forgot to buy me milk. <laughs> but at least he bought her milk. So what we did is we gave her yogurt and milk mixed in together so that she at least is make sure she's full, she's not hungry during the evening. So she was drinking the milk with the yogurt in and the oldest wanted time with daddy, so um so she wanted yogurt and he like gave her yogurt like she was in bed by 9.05 so um, he was just giving her yogurt and then she was in bed with yogurt. Okay, so by 7.27 my youngest was still crying so um, we checked both nappies was wet and we changed it and gave her medicine as well. So we gave her medicine. So I forgot to give her medicine before she went into bed. Um, my youngest, uh, she's on medicine for eczema, but yeah, so that's a story for another day. But so, um, yeah, so both the children's nappies was dirty by this time. I wasn't very happy, but I understood because <laughs> so she was crying. My oldest was crying because um, every time she starts on the toilet, she was crying and said, ow, 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 ow. And I didn't know what the problem is, so I thought her tummy is hard, so I gave her water just before she going back to bed. So I gave her water and then um, when, so then I put her back on the toilet and she's still crying, ow, 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 ow. And when I wanted to put a bit nappy on, I saw it was um, cut open. So I put on stuff that is cut. That was that she cut where it was cut, and then I um, 
put a nappy on and then like after this while well, it was fine but she still had a lot of water in the tummy <laughs> so um we changed both of their nappies by this time by um, 7.27 so we also went both us in the bed we went to shower and that fixed everything and then we got this so that's why it took so long as well but um by 7 37 she was both of them was back in bed we offered bottle again and she refused the bottle but then all of it was almost finished so um she refused the bottle by nine i mean seven seven fifty three um she sounded quiet for like a minute or two <laughs> And then I said, lol, no, or not. And then she started to cry for the next few minutes. She was crying until, but it was like crying, like, eh, stop for a few minutes, eh, stop for a few minutes, eh, stop for a few minutes, and so forth. So she was crying, but we know she just wanted to, and let me bother this time. So, stem 807, she was asleep. She woke up by, my oldest woke up and actually got into bed by daddy, but that's a story for another thing. <laughs> and, <laughs> but yeah, um, so at f four o'clock we put her, like the oldest back in bed, she just went to bed, nothing happened and everything. Five o'clock, she got awake. So she saw sleeping from eight o'clock to five o'clock. We changed the nappy, put her back in bed by 5.10. Um, she was crying, but like started to relax by 5.40 around there. Just when I wanted to go into bed, she was like stopping, going, stopping, going, stopping, going. And then um, she started to relax, started to relax and then few minutes after that about like five minutes after that she was trying to cry again and by six o'clock I gave her milk so then I then I walked into the room just before six o'clock I walked into the room got the milk bottle the bottle of milk and then put milk in and gave it to her she was drinking in and by six I didn't take her out of the bed, I just put her back. She was, by this time she was sitting. She wasn't laying anymore, she was sitting straight. So I just wanted to offer the milk to see if she wanted to drink it and go back to sleep again. Or does she just want to sleep? And looking for the dummy. But, um, so six o'clock I gave her the milk and she was, um, so she drank the milk. By 6.15, she was sleeping, gone. I didn't hear her anymore. It is now 8.13 <laughs> and they're still sleeping. So that is plus one, it's brilliant. So for the first night, they slept a total of 12 hours on this apartment. 12 hours and 20 minutes, but they woke up once, which and we gave milk and everything so tummy is full medicine that work but so it's just a bit of allergic medicine but not drowsy medicine but oh, there is one that is a bit drowsy but that is for when she's her worst so on the moment she's very badly so everything is oh, and why it took so long changing the nappy is I put on cream all over her like her arms and her legs and a tummy and her back so that the cream can that she's not that dry anymore so I don't know if you have someone with eczema but that is what I did so that's why it took from 5 to 5 10 and then 5 40 she was relaxed and sleeping so she's now sleeping the total of two hours by now but yes so that is that. <laughs> That's the story. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, so I'll edit this video, try to edit it and put it out straight away. Um, don't know what time you will get it, but I will try to set it out straight away. And then you have this. So this is real time. All of the other videos is not real time, but this one will be real time. 
so that I know it's out and it's done and it's finished and we have accomplished the first night without a dummy <laughs> very excited about this I didn't know it will be going that's good but it did I don't know which evening will be bad, worst and which evening won't but if you can get this far it's like number one like we did it so no problem so this is the situation and yes so hope you enjoyed this video come and join me you will see come like that video was in for last year in june -ish. June, yes, so June was I'm busy with a traveling video from last year. So this is all pre pre-recorded. This is literally real time me having a messy counter. Don't look at it. No joke. But yeah, you will see lots of videos. It's cleaning videos, there's all kind of strange videos and all kind of things. My daughter is now on this moment. It's 21 months this month this in 10 days she will be 21 months so you can do it even if they're older you didn't have that big of a problem but all this story so i'm going to see if i will be able to upload those videos on my computer and see what is going on and we'll be editing try to edit it while going on this day i don't think it will be done during this during today but we'll see what is going on Missy! Hey there! But yes, enjoy! See you next time and I hope you enjoyed this video. Good luck, bye! Okay, so it's the afternoon. <laughs> They're now both in bed. She woke up. It's quarter to ten. So I just wanted to close with that. She woke up this morning, quarter to ten, and I've put her now in the cot, like five minutes ago, with a bottle again, and she only made like, eh, and then didn't hurt anything again. So hopefully, but yes, um, I just wanted to update you on this before I am clothing, closing this and then editing it. So enjoy <laughs> hopefully it is done no problem with it anymore <laughs> but we'll see um i'll keep you updated on the way on the go and so forth but i'm editing this now yeah and then i am done good luck enjoy bye see you in the next one